ready to rumble. We are getting ready to rumble. Welcome back to the vlog everyone. We're off to a bike race. I know, it's been a while. It's been two months, but it's happened again. We're off to Worcester. We're going to race the Pulse Event Mega Cross at Top Barn Farm, um, just outside Worcester. Um, it's raining. It's proper cross conditions today. Um, and it's going to be a great day. So I've got Jim with me and he's going to take the vlog over when I'm racing. And, and uh, yeah, it's going to be a good day and I'll uh, show you what's going on. So fun fact, fun fact Jim, Go on. this is where I did some uni course oh, stuff. So I actually yeah. went to uni time. here yeah. and did loads of activities on this lake. The raft building, I've fallen in this lake and everything. And here's John. Hello, Merry Christmas. John is back on the vlog everyone. <laughs> He's got my bikes, my shiny Vitus bike. Right, I am number 127 today. It's fixing my shoes. video um, that should give you a bit of a clue clue I'm here at my second ever cyclocross race uh, oh God, I'm quite confused I don't really know how this works or why anyone would want to take part um, it seems like a very wet cold muddy slog through hell from the first one I ever saw right then looks like they're lining up for the start Sorry about the wind, we've lost a little mic cover. Beth looks to be somewhere near the front in the minute. She's starting on the front, which I guess is good. That was exciting. They're going by. Um, I think I missed Beth already. I have no idea where the course is going. It's quite hard to make out this. This looks like a bit of a mess, wiggling all over the place. Go! 
going fast. Right, I'll be honest, I've got no idea what's going on. I don't get this track, you know, it's just like zigzagging all over the place. It doesn't make sense. One bit, one minute you think they're going to come from one place and the next they're coming from behind you. I don't even know who's in the lead. Bloody hell, look at him go. That really does look awful. Here she comes. Go on, Beth. Oh, didn't look too happy there, did she? Never mind. Don't wear her in this weather. Meanwhile, ooh, lucky me. Ham salad sandwich. So I just missed her again. Hmm, yeah. Uh, I was eating the sandwich. She looks like she's doing alright though. She looks good. Rain's easing up a bit. Um, I still have no idea what position she's in or, or what's going on really. She's very determined. It's very determined right now. Yeah. All right, so from what I can make out, better than like fifth, sixth place. Don't really know. The winners come across. This is this is second place. There you go. Um, and I'm just waiting to get a photo of the finish. She should be here in a minute. I hope so. I need a brew. Come right, she's coming in now. She looks pretty knackered. Let's try and get a photo. Yuck. This is the reality of cross. Very wet and muddy. That, that was fun. I am filthy. I like Jim. You are. I'm filthy. You are filthy. Oh my goodness me, look at the lines in my forehead. Well anyway, that was a bit of a slog. Very muddy slog. I think I finished like fifth. We'll take that for not a lot of training in a minute. Very filthy bike. Thank you for cleaning Dad. Thank you. Okay. Post-race cup of tea and sandwiches. And a mince pie. And a mince pie. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm on video again. We're just watching Bruce race now. The men's race. Um, I've been it's taking me ages to get changed, so I haven't really got much for it today, have I? Do you know what else is noteworthy? She had an umbrella in the van the whole time. I never knew about it. I told you about the it. Pissing rain. <laughs> Ugh. You look a lot filthier than I was. Yeah, I think that's just because it rained more in your race and it cleaned it off and now it did. got really, really muddy. Or... Do you know what, personal uh, experience today. My first time I've bunny hopped the hurdles every time in a race. Did you? Know. That's one very muddy biter spike. Fair fight as well. Yeah. Go on. This is a new segment we like to call Bethany Mechanic. <laughs> she's turning it the wrong way. I'm doing it the wrong way. She's, tight, she's trying to take it off. And she's tightening it up. Oh. Lefty Lucy. Oh, Lefty tighty. There we go. There we go. And that is how you take off a different It's very easy once you know how to do it. <laughs> Ta -da! We should just, just take um. Time to go home. Right, we're going home now, aren't we, Jim? We're like the last one to leave because we've been chatting away. Anyway, got some new kit off Bruce, that's all good. I've got a new turbo trainer so I can train now. And uh, yeah, it's been a wet and muddy day. Typical that it's stopped raining now. That'll last. That'll last. Anyway, we're going home for pizza. Later. Pizza! Right. Oh, God. Voice. 
morning it's monday so it's time to start the dreaded um clean up process which is you know the worst part of ever going to any cross race um gotta get all that the muddy clothes rinse them down put it in the washing machine and my van is a mess so oh but luckily i don't start work till two so i've got all morning to kind of sort it out which is quite nice um it was dark when we got back last night so was not doing it then um yeah so better get cracking really um and get cleaned up <laughs> Got my new smart trainer, um, so I can start doing some good sessions again. Um, I haven't had my treadmill for seven weeks, so um, this one is a bit more smaller, a bit more compact, and it's from one of our sponsors, WKG Sports. Um, we're part of the team, um, so looking forward to getting this out of the box and giving it a try. I think this pot lid could do with a bit of a clean. Just going to use some kitchen roll, some hot water. <laughs> So it's a bit damp on the inside still so I need to put it to dry but what I've learned from mistakes in the past is do not put a helmet right in front of a fire because it does melt. Um, so I'm just going to hang it nearby um, so it gets some heat to dry it but it's not in direct contact with it so it's not going to melt. Um, I did that last year to a helmet um, and it literally just went there. So don't do that. Trust me. <laughs> Clean. So that was my race weekend. Um, I hope you enjoyed coming along with me. Um, it was just a small local event, but I mean, at the minute, we have to take everything we can get. That's all the racing that's on at the minute in this country. Hopefully next year we can get back to some, yeah, normality of some actual racing. But um, to, it was cool to go and race today. Um, I mean, I'm really unfit at the minute. I've got mm, zero race fitness. I just haven't been training. Um, life's changed a lot recently. I've moved out. Um, I'm working a lot more than I've ever been used to. So I'm trying to find that balance again and I'll, I'll be ready to go in 2021. Um, that's what I'm looking forward to now. Um, and hopefully some more epic trips and more racing. So that's what I'm looking forward to at the minute. But big thanks to John. Um, for coming along over to watch me race and he brought over my race kit and everything which is still at home at the minute so he's looking after all of that and keeping it in good nick at uh, John's bike shed. Uh, yeah and then Jim who came along with me it was kind of his second cross race as you can tell in this video um, he's still very confused by why we do it but I keep telling him it's because we love doing it and uh, yeah he'll learn why it's great eventually and um Cheers to Bruce for bringing over my new turbo, giving us some cheers. Um, great to have another rider of CX Syndicate there. And yeah, um, looking forward to more races with the team, hopefully in the future, um, in the new year now, because Christmas is next. I can't believe it. It's in like 10 days time. So yeah, it's going to be a different Christmas and I hope everyone has a lovely Christmas, wherever they are. And let's hope for a better 2021 than 2020. Happy New Year, guys, as well. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos coming in the new year. Every like, every subscribe helps and looking forward to maybe bringing you some more videos and doing some cool stuff.